टुडे वी विल डिस्कस मेजर ऑफ सेंट्रल टेंडेंसी देर आर थ्री मेजर ऑफ सेंट्रल टेंडेंसी वन एज मेन सेकेंड एज मीडियम एंड थर्ड एज मोड मीन मीडियम एंड मोड फर्स्ट लेट डिस्कस अबाउट द मीन हाउ टू गेट द मीन ऑफ ग्रुप डेटा एंड अनग्रुप डेटा सपोज देर आर marks obtained here this x shows the marks obtained by the students and this f shows frequency of the students suppose 10 20 36 40 Fifteen, fifty-six, sixteen, seventeen, seventy-two, eighteen, eighty-eight, ninety-two, ninety-five. That was the marks obtained by the student, and this represents the one student who got marks ten, one who got twenty, three student who got marks thirty-six, four got marks forty. Now this is the marks obtained by the student and the frequency of the marks obtained. In this particular case, how we can find out the mean of this ungrouped data? First, we need to find out x multiplied by f. That is f x. So this would be if you multiply that. 10 into 110 20 into 120 right so this is fx now we need to find out the summation of fx that is sigma fx this is known as summation of fx if we add them together that comes to 1779 that comes to 1779 we have the marks obtained by the student this shows the number of students who got marks 10 there are one student who got marks 20 there are three students who got marks 50 and so on to find out arithmetic mean we need to find out f into x and the summation of x now formula for finding out arithmetic mean is that is shown by x bar the formula is sigma f into x divided by sigma f how uh, sigma f can be found from here sigma f is the total number of students in a class sigma f is if we add them together 30 so there are two total 30 students in the class in that case arithmetic mean would be sigma f x 1779 divided by 30 1779 divided by 30 that comes to 59.3 so average marks of the class 